Hi, welcome back to me and Monami. And you might be wondering where I am. Well, today I'm in a very small, but very nice uh, hotel room in King's Cross in London. Um, I've been here to uh, go to a friend's 50th birthday party. And this morning I'm gonna fly back to Nice. Now I'm going to do it via City Airport. Now City Airport is one of the few airports in the country that has these brand new CT scanners installed across the whole airport, which apparently are meant to mean that you don't have to take all your computers, electronics, liquids out of your bag. It also means apparently that you can take liquids up to two liters big. So what I'm gonna do now is uh, nip down the local Tesco, get, um, well, all the things that I love to take back to Nice and usually have to take in a suitcase and behold, uh, including a two liter bottle of lemonade. And um, well, let's put this, uh, put this thing to the test. So this is something I can never do is bring back loads of deodorant because these bottles are 200 mils. And deodorant is very expensive in France and uh, these two two pounds each but let's hope we get them through the scanner now where's my tea bags say a big thank you to everybody who sent tea to France the problem is when we get it through the post we've been landed with import taxes the post brexit import taxes so it's making it a bit expensive <laughs> But those of you who brought it out for us, thank you so much. Um, where is Twining's breakfast? Oh, self-service machines, how I've missed you. Toothpaste, we wouldn't normally be able to take that. And then we'll compromise with these everyday bags. So um, I've got the rules here, leave it in the bag. It says no more plastic bags. Our CT security scanners can now scan liquids and electronics inside. What to do at security? Leave liquids, laptops, tablets, other electronic devices inside the hand luggage. Liquids and gels only allowed in containers up to two liters. Only one cigarette lighter, I haven't got one of them. And you have to declare your camera film. Well, let's pack the bag. So I have got quite a lot of deodorant. I've also got some toothpaste, which again would not go through a normal scanner. Um, tea bags, that would have gone, I think, through a normal scanner. They certainly, certainly would not have passed anything, passed anywhere. anything anywhere. And I wonder if it'll pass at London City. I'm not looking forward to carrying it. Anyway, let's see if we can get it all in the old bag. Um, get all these in. So that's about eight deodorants. And to open a little shopping bill for our toothpaste. Um, I need to leave room for my uh, <laughs> for my uh, lemonade. Slightly we're going to get the lemonade just to prove a point. Oh my god, the weight! Um, and the tea bags can go on top of there. And uh, we are almost good to go. So, this one, Elmwood House. I mean, it's very basic, it's very simple, but it's clean and it works. And it's Argyle Square and King's Cross Station's right over there. So it's got a lot going for it. Not least the fact it was about 80 pounds on a Saturday night. I'm going to get a prep breakfast roll just to keep me going. I've not got any hot ones, I don't want cold. I've decided I can't be bothered. They haven't got a hot thing and I don't want that for four quid. It's just too much. I have a dream. the driverless Docklands Light Railway. Look, no driver. All remote control. Been like this for 
30 years maybe. So you'll get the picture, this is a much, much smaller airport than any of us in London. It usually makes it much easier. The only downer is quite often the flights are more expensive to Nice from here. But my one I booked about a month in advance and was I think about £80, which given it's middle of the day, etc, etc. And you've got much, much reduced transfer costs from central London because you're just coming on the tube rather than the silly Eater Express at 20 quid or whatever, or more. Um, it's quite a good deal. Let's see what happens with the bags and the security. Thank you. Thank you. So here are the scanners. The moment of truth approaches. Will my two litre bottle get through? No, that's good. So I'm through, but will my stuff come through with all that liquid in? Or will it be sent into the, uh, sent into the naughty aisle? Quite a lot going the other way. Is mine going to go the other way? We shall see, here it comes, moment of decision. Oh, it's gone into the naughty aisle. Say, I have to say, there's a lot of stuff gone into the naughty aisle. I'd say 50% of what just came through made the naughty aisle, so you're still held up being searched. A lot of waiting, I'm sat down. That was very interesting. Very nice uh, lady uh, dealt with my <laughs> bag. Uh, what happened? Well, 50%, as I say, of all the bags I think that went through were opened up. So there was certainly no speeding up of the system. Uh, she opened my bag up. I wasn't surprised about that to have all those deodorants and, and bottles. But to be honest, all she actually wanted to do, the two litre bottle of lemonade was no problem. But what she wanted to check was deodorant and not all of them just one of them uh, so it was you know it was all handled very nicely but it probably took 10 minutes so I have to say I hate to be a bit of a downer I'm not sure it's going to be that much quicker but what it does mean is you can bring things like I brought you can bring deodorants you can bring bottles you don't have to lose your perfumes and all the rest of it but the thing you've got to be really, really careful of in this situation is don't forget that you may have been coming from an airport which didn't have that scanner, so your perfumes, etc., would have been taken off you before you flew. So, you know, you've got to check that the airports you are dealing with, both ends of the airport, you know, the departure airport, the arrival airport, has those scanners because if the rules aren't the same, you will still be caught out. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, please give us a like, please give us a comment, please think about buying us a coffee. And remember, subscribe to me and Monami and stay charged. Bye.